You're listening to the main This message goes out to all the Samoans all over the world. All over the world. Our country, our country needs you. The children of Samoa needs you. Samoa needs you. We are here, we are here, we are here. Sometimes you know words just fail to to express how you feel. I think the prime minister reflects the power of the state. A head of state reflects, you know, the soul of a people. And uh, I think, for me at the least, you know, it's a heavy responsibility. How do you provide uh, something that sustains you? The death toll is rising after the twin earthquakes which have shaken our region. but the devastation they brought with them remains. Tens of thousands of survivors across the islands need help. Look, I've been talking to people all day long who have been in tears, and along with everyone else, we've witnessed things that a human being shouldn't have to witness. Entire villages were destroyed by the tsunami. An 8.3 magnitude earthquake sent a series of waves up to six meters high crashing into the coastlines of the Samoan Islands and Tonga. Witnesses have described it as a river of mud carrying cars, buses, and boats inland. This will be home for now. I'll be 
ti apolo ma tu ai olu fa ba ta fo la o ma ta tu na ma o si o fa na o ha o olu ta me tu so ma na la ha ma tu e le to ta a se la ba I was holding the hand of my grandchild when the wave hit us. I didn't know what happened. I just couldn't hold him more. We got separated. I couldn't see him anymore. Branches and debris were hitting my body. Everything was being carried away. I couldn't see the children. I lost them. Prime Minister to the Epa Sailele. We had some donations, uh, but for far short.